did see their cars swept away this morning by those rushing floodwaters. Our Johan Marin joins us live in the studio with a look at the damage in the Benson area. John, Aaron, this is at Oakview Apartments on North 70th Circle. Residents described this morning's flooding as a nightmare. At least seven cars were swept away. Several garages are also damaged, as you can see. But many residents tell me, despite the dangerous situation, they're thankful no one is hurt. Hours after a severe storm flooded the area, water still filled the Oakview Apartments parking lot. It was just unreal how much water. Deb Tiemann saw the situation unfold in a matter of minutes. The water was coming in, that garage open, and it was all the way to the top coming in. Then I saw the cars be like bumper cars and just float everywhere. Several of those cars now sit by the creek next to the complex. The Nissan Versa stuck in a tree belongs to Tiemann. When you see your car float away, that's a nightmare. Making matters worse, Tiemann moved in 21 days ago. Her personal belongings were still in one of the garages damaged in the storm. I lost everything in my garage down there. It's in the creek and on the trees. Eve Puro tells Six News she was planning to move out today. That, that was our car. I don't even know, like, we don't have another car, so. Puro and Tiemann contacted the apartment for help, but did not get a quick response, leaving them both stuck, waiting for answers. We don't know really what to do yet. Um, we're in the dark of what to do, but we do need some help. I did reach out to the apartment's complex property management company. They tell me they know about the situation and they're working on coming here in the next few days to look at the damage and help residents figure out insurance coverage. On your side, I'm Johan Marin, 6 News.